Hey YouTubers, just want to make a, another video regarding this starter motor. So a few of you know, have watched my video before in regards to the fault I had with my starter motor, with the bolts breaking, so you can watch that video. Um, if you subscribe, you'll find that there. Um, and work out what I did with getting that bolt out. So I fixed that with the existing starter motor. I've been having problems with it, um, not always, pin not always firing out and turning over the engine. I'll turn the key, it will turn once, then it'll start spinning, and then I've got to turn the key on and then hit it again. Um, it's predominantly when it's warm, so when I've been out and I pull up at a um, an island, one of the beaches here in um, Queensland, Australia, and it just doesn't start. So when and got myself a, another starter motor, so I went on YouTube, on um, on eBay and had a look uh, for some starter motors, and I came up with. Um, a starter motor that was coming out of a um, place in Sydney. So I've ordered that and I'm going to put that in now and see if that fixes it. So um, just one other thing while I've got you all is this fuel line here running from the carby down to the fuel pump. I just replaced that um, with some Tigon fuel line so that was uh, a job I had to do during the week I had to locate that Tigon fuel line no one had it in that diameter um, at a local mechanic or at, at a local um, retail shop so I had to special order that in from fuel lines Australia so um, finally came in and there we go, it went straight on. So the other one was old and brittle. You might see that in the old video. I had to see how um, brittle it was. I just thought I better change it. So um, there's the rest of it there. So two meters of that cost me $14. So anyway, <clears throat> here's the new starter motor. So there you go. That's where I got it from. Um, so hopefully this works. The reviews online were, were good for it. So hopefully um, Susan Sue won't be getting a phone call from me. But um, look, it comes obviously packed really well. On the box um, comes with the two bolts. So they're 40 mil ends. Um, and there it is there. DSM Motorsports. So, not a bad looking um, starter. So, hopefully this uh, works and solves my um, my problems. So, let me pause this video and. I'll get back to it. Alright, I'm back. And I've got the old starter motor out, which goes there. So, made sure I killed the battery. So there's no power going through to it. And, um, there's the old one. So, looks pretty beat it up as well and uh, there's a new one so pretty much uh, identical so that should um, that should work well yes. so it just goes straight up those two bolts slides it straight up which is the same as that one so 
to try and um, well that just looks a whole lot nicer as opposed to that so let's put the new one in shouldn't be too difficult so like I said comes with the bolts already um, two 14 mils and let's um, let's get it in the boat let's hook it back up I'll show you the uh, once it's installed all right I'm back there's the tools there's the old bolts out um, just use my angle screw uh, angle drill um, to start the bolts off and then obviously use it to loosen them and use it to screw them up quickly so you're not doing quarter return or all the time and then once you get it all the way up then get the uh, socket back out and um, tighten them up so uh, there's the old one it is out and the new one is in looks good so hopefully that will work well and um, I'll start her up soon I'll put the muffs on it and I'll start it up so thanks to all the other youtubers out there as well um, all these videos come in handy so to all those guys that want to have a turn and think that they can't um, I'm not a mechanic by any stretch um, but yeah YouTube is very very handy for this and um, I just thought well if I do it I'll get to know this engine and I would be able to do the maintenance and <coughs> keep it um, keep it maintained so hopefully keep the cost down so thanks very much thanks for watching if you like it subscribe and um, the next one I'm going to do is uh, my oil change with the um, oil filter down there so I've got the oil I bought the oil filter so let's see um, how we go all right thanks for watching Bye.